hi in this video i'm going to talk about the best books on econometrics econometrics is a very broad area it's a very vast field so there's no one size fit all tool it depends on why you are studying econometrics are you studying to do research or you're starting to do um, research on unrelated topics such as you just want to know the basics of econometrics to do some, some sort of research or you are trying to study econometrics to apply it in industry so it all depends on the purpose for which you are studying econometrics and uh, accordingly i can recommend you to the best book for for your given purpose for beginners for absolute beginners the wonderful book is the introduction to economics by damodar and gujarati uh, it's a very good book um, very beginner friendly so if you're new to this area you will find this book very good you can also use the book by green uh, it's uh, another wonderful book for beginners but if you really want to get into the details of everything these books may not be very useful so if you're an undergrad your undergrad or just uh, entering a post grad you are new to econometrics these two books are very very good but if you really want to do graduate level study then you have to learn more advanced econometrics books and the two books that come to my mind are the one first one is the advanced econometric theory by john chipman and the second one is the ulrich uh the econometric analysis uh, by ulrich uh, both these books are wonderful books uh, written by top econometricians from top in us universities so you will find these two books uh, very good so after having gone through the first uh, you know the introductory books damodaran and and green you can venture into these two advanced books and specifically for doing your graduate level courses in econometrics for undergrads these books are probably not necessary if you are uh, working in industry and want to use uh, econometrics in your analysis then ulrich is a very good book especially those coming from high mathematical uh, background ulrich is a wonderful book uh if you're from maths or uh, physics background wanting to uh, study econometrics ulrich is a very good book because there's a lot of theoretical aspect of it which you can un uh, understand very well given your mathematical background but at the same time there's a lot of applications of it which is clearly um, a w another good thing about the book but if you're not from that level of quantitative background then you should go some for something like uh, gujarati or green um if you want to learn time series or panel data modeling um there are not many good books actually on time series because most of the econometrics books focus only uh, the basics of time series but there uh, so there are not too many options you have the one by uh, hamilton is the very famous one but it's a difficult book actually uh, even for graduate students it's a very difficult book heavily theoretical so if you are somebody not very keen on learning the theory behind time series analysis you will not find this book very interesting but if you are heavily into theory this is uh, this is a wonderful book for stochastic analysis as well as for time series analysis and then um the, the other one is the time series analysis and applications with r example it's from the springer um it's a uh, more applications of time series analysis rather than uh, theory of time series analysis so if you're working in financial service industry um uh, and you want to use time series analysis for macroeconomic forecasting then the second book is is more ideal for more suited for you then non parametric modeling non parametric modeling is not very popular in econometrics unlike in machine learning but there are still some books you can uh, on on non parametric modeling one is by non parametric econometrics by pegan and wa is published by the oxford uh, press uh, oxford publications and it's uh, it's a good one and then the introduction to statistical learning and element of statistical learning the two books by hasty and and thipsrani two great statisticians from stanford university um it's not focused on non parametric uh, econometrics but also statistical learning which is you know somewhat in many ways related to non parametric econometrics 
but um, there's a lot more to it actually right it's not just econometrics there is also some part of machine learning they have they have discussed in these two books so these are some of the books you can um, you can study and these are related to machine learning so yeah if you are a machine learning researcher also you'll find these books quite useful then applied econometrics books which can be used um, to do something in right not just learn the theory or not just the academic stuff but also some examples of industry right econometrics is heavily used in the industry specifically the time series analysis which is used for macroeconomic forecasting in banks and insurance companies and then so such uh, books are very use very uh, useful in the industry and as industry practitioner you should be learning them so introduction to econometrics by econometrics for finance is chris brooks brooks it's a wonderful book uh, for applied people who want to learn econometrics use of econometrics in finance and then the other book was the econometrics for financial markets so that is another good book um, both are available on amazon so if you have already studied econometrics and you know a bit of econometrics these two books are very good uh, if you want to use them use the econometrics techniques in in the industry um, and you, you really want to know the applied stuff these two books are very good all right thanks